A lot of times RTI, response to intervention, is discussed in terms of tiers of services. Tier one being the classroom where all children receive instruction geared toward the state standards. Tier two is the next level of services provided only to those students who might need some extra support, some supplementary services. Often that might be 20 to 30 percent of the students in a school. The third tier of response to intervention is uh, tier three, more intensive services. Some schools refer to that, use that to describe their special education services. Now how does that uh, three-tier response uh, differ from typical three-tier response, which would be classroom placement, remedial services, and then special ed? A lot of people are having difficulty with that difference between what we're trying to do with response to intervention and what we've been doing. People look at the classroom, special, or special services, remedial services such as Title I, or special education saying, is RTI just renaming those things? But there are some, some real differences. The typical way of doing things at the classroom, remedial, special education requires that students qualify for those services. Um, a, a beloved uh, a term that people have used is wait to fail, that students had to wait to uh, fail significantly, wait to fall further and further behind before they could qualify for those services. RTI turns that notion on its head that students get receive the services that they need as soon as we identify and we use assessments more strategically to be actively looking for those students.